I heard that you called me fake. And then, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Someone told me that supposedly she was like, yeah, I feel like Kaylin's nice, but I feel like it's just fake. She said that about you? Yeah. I feel like she's like really fake and she just kisses everyone. So I just went a completely different way and I did not expect this to happen. Kaylin, you're gonna cry just being in a Halloween store. Yes, Something's gonna move, I know it. Something's gonna move, we're in a Halloween store. It's not like we're in like, I know, but that could like be like, Kaylin, you should be a cat woman. Yeah, no, scary things are not my thing. Guys, how are we feeling about these? Um, you want to wear what the are those? I'm not sure. Are those like devil horns, but There's black? There's on your head. <laughs> oh, that's the mood. <laughs> the music video was like the last time we all were completely, oh geez, together. And the last time we were all together, Kyle was just like, the song is about you. Uh, what's the inspiration behind your music? Uh, well, Kaylin kept talking about how I was ruining her reputation, so. I feel it's kind of annoying. Like, I never want to talk bad about my own cousin. Just the things he does are, like, disrespectful. He clearly doesn't care about his reputation, yeah. let alone mine. That makes sense, kind of, for him to make a song about my reputation, because he's like, oh, I don't care about mine, like, with the stuff he does. It just annoyed me. He can be so much better than that, you know? If he's trying to, like, have, like, a career, do that stuff, you can't act like that. Like, you guys, we all know that you can't do that, you know? Yeah. So I just think it's, like, some of the things he does are, like, super disrespectful. Thank you for coming and meeting me for lunch. Of course. Yeah. This will be fun. We'll yeah, catch we... up and stuff. I have a lot to talk about, so. Oh gosh. Okay, mm -hmm. fill me in. Are you excited for Queen Mary? Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna be so scared. I'm so excited. I'm so into this stuff. Why? It's haunted, paranormal activity. Why are you excited for that? It's so cool. Scarlett's gonna have like a panic attack and I'm gonna be like, they're crying. No, Kaylin's like, gonna run to Micah. Probably cry. I'm gonna, gonna like, cry. Yeah, I'm gonna You're cry. You're gonna run to Jad. Uh, definitely not. Okay, so now, the interesting stuff. Oh God. I'm like annoyed with all you guys. Why? Low key, dead <laughs> Not gonna lie. All oh, you guys are being shady. You, Scarlett, Kaylin. I send a text in the group chat. No one responds to Rock Kelson's one. Literally two seconds after everyone responds. Well, the reason why I've like kind of kept my distance is because like I heard that you called me fake. And then yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so what was going on with Shelby? At the video shoot, like you guys weren't really talking, were you? No, it was just kind of awkward. Someone told me that supposedly she was like, yeah, I feel like Kaylin's nice, but I feel like it's just fake. She said that about you? Yeah. No. So one, that's not real. And yeah, I called you fake because you're rude to me. I feel like she's like really fake and she just kisses everyone's ass. And I'm literally straight up with everyone on. That's why everyone's being annoying towards me because I'm literally real. No offense, I don't like Micah. I'm not gonna lie about him, be fake about it. I told him and I told Kaylin. Okay. I've literally told everyone. I told, I'm not fake with Jad. I told everyone I don't like Jad. Like, I'm literally straight up. I thought she was just gonna like, tell me that she's like upset about Scarlett and Kaylin like hanging out without her and I was like gonna be there for her and like, try to resolve our issues. I don't know, it just went a completely different way and I did not expect this to happen. Yeah, but the thing is like you were fake with me. You didn't say that to my face, did you? This is someone else. Yeah, Scarlett, and that's why we're talking about it now so I could tell yeah. you. Yeah, I know, but you're asking why do you think I've been keeping my distance because I heard what you said. You literally called me a kiss to my face yeah, I'm not the day saying. of the shoot. Because you were kissing everyone's ass. I feel like ever since we started hanging out with adding Scarlett to the group, even though she was the one that introduced her to us, she's gotten even more weird. I think she thinks that bringing her in the group was like gonna help Shelby and then they would be closer, but I was like but realistically worse for her. Me and Scarlett have always been friends. Obviously, like you guys are gonna Obviously, be close we're gonna be close, Shelby. yeah. So. No, I don't know what her thinking was there, though. I don't know either. I don't have an issue with anybody, so I don't feel like necessary to talk about anything. Like, if they want to talk to me, okay, like, I don't have an issue. You have no job with everyone, so you're like, oh yeah, I agree, I agree to this. I you're literally not being yourself. Like, Kaylin says stuff behind you, but she asks, like, what your they best say friend. To me? I'm not gonna say it right now, because I'm not gonna, like, try and hurt your feelings, but this happened when me and Kaylin were just trying to be friends again. Like, you don't understand, you guys have been rude to me since me and Kaylin started having issues because all you guys were friends with Kaylin before. I'm literally the outcast of this whole friend group. Like, you don't understand, that's why I brought Scarlett onto this, because me and Scarlett were friends. And Scarlett's like, oh, I'll help you and Kaylin, because she's really good friends with me and Kaylin. Mm -hmm. 
And next thing you know, Scarlett's not here for me anymore. Now she's with you and Kaylin in your little Three Musketeer group. I'm being straight up with you. Like, this is why I'm not getting along with anyone because all you guys are fake towards each other. Kaylin and I have known each other for so long. Like, I've known Kaylin longer than you. Okay, whoop de doo She says things that are just really uncalled for. She says that she's so straight up, but like, if she really had a problem with me, she didn't say it to my face. I don't know, I don't think I could be friends with someone who like, does that to me. You know how like, Jad's trying to be like, good with me and everything? Yeah. They, he asked me to pick up him and Kyle to bring them to Queen Mary's. Shut up. Swear. You have to like, ask him, like, what's up? Yeah, just be like, what's, yeah. Up, like, what's going on? See this? Yeah. yeah. I can't wait sure. to drive with them. Oh my god. I'm gonna like try to see what he's thinking in their thought process. See what's going on. Because it's really not worth it. In the end, you only have your family, so. Probably gonna have so to annoyed. Ask I'm probably gonna, gonna like, want to crash like, the car. <laughs> well, like, oh, sorry guys. My sorry guys. Like, slam on your brakes. You're like, oh, Brakes. I'll check them like 12 times. <laughs> like, sorry, my bad. My bad. <laughs> Please do that. So what happened like with you and Kaylin? Like, what's your side? Because me and Brittany were with her earlier today and like she said that she felt really bad because she thought it was about her. What was about her? I never would I write a song about my own cousin saying to do with I don't care about your reputation. Kaylin's reputation is golden to me. Like that's my cousin. You don't understand that's yeah. family. Kaylin's the homie cow would never that's, like ever. That's what I'm saying though. Like I was talking sense. to Kaylin about it. Honestly, you guys need to work it out because you guys are family. No, but don't you agree? Thing, I think your Scarlet instigated that. I think Scarlet instigated it. Are you guys excited for tonight? I'm, I'm so, so scared. I'm so, I'm so scared. This is gonna be so funny. It's gonna this is gonna be so, so interesting. Funny. And I'm mad at Kyle because he's being so disrespectful. He's being so mean to me and just uncalled for like, okay, don't even call and tell me that you're here and stay with dad, have him pick you up from the airport, like stay with him, like do everything with him and then leave me in the dust. You need to work things out with her because that is, like you said, that's family. Yeah. You so when it comes to working family. out with her, I'll apologize for the fact that she thought that. But more importantly than apologizing is, I need to no, no, I need to tell her that Scarlet instigated that. There's snakes around her, and that's what I'm worried about because that's my family. Yeah, it's definitely it's Scarlet. Scarlet. I do not trust her as far as I can spit. And then we also have beef with Shelby. Yeah. So like, I don't know how that's gonna go down. You guys know I like talked to her this morning. Today? Like, yeah. I we like went that. and we went out to eat, okay? And she was like talking to me how like she's really upset and that like you were her Why? friend I and that Kaylin first though. I now have this issue. I don't even know what that's gonna happen. And then Kaylin has the same issue and then like Scarlett's just like in the middle of all of it. So honestly, like I can't trust Scarlett only because ever since she joined this group, she's hung out with us like once or twice and she's already starting drama for us. The first drama she started was telling Kaylin that the song was about her. The like, second thing she started yeah. was in the group chat she with was us so and the girls. She was unbelievably rude to us when Raquel was just trying to make a suggestion on things we should do. And, and then she was so rude. She was so rude, but honestly, you can't do. fight fire with fire. Yes, you can, watch me. Brittany, you're all being straight up and being fiery, watch me. Um, Kyle's like hellfire and Scarlett's like bonfires. Okay, like whatever. I was just trying to be like nice, but she was always like friends with Scarlett, and now she's hanging out with Kaylin, and they're all buddy buddy now. And We've like, always been buddy buddy now. Yeah. No, but the reason how I know Shelby is because I met her at Kaylin's house. I've never like been closer with Shelby than I am with Kaylin. I've always been super close with Kaylin, and since you're Kaylin's best friend, like yeah. obviously we're all gonna hang out. Well, I mean, maybe they like have an issue because like, you talk behind everyone's back. Before I met you, I said Kaylin was like, oh, I want to introduce you to Brooke. Like, she's super sweet. And I was like, well, Shelby told me, like, she's a little bit fake. I'm the fake one! Nobody's going to resolve their problems with Shelby. Like, I don't know what to do at this point. It's like she hasn't talked behind my back. Don't say you haven't talked behind my back when other people are telling me to. Like, that's being fake too. Like, not admitting it. Like, at least admit it. I go by honesty. And if she's yeah. not going to be honest with you, then there's really nothing you can do. Yeah. 